My mom is a huge fan of leopard print, so I just have really bad memories associated with that. Sorry, mom. Today, we are reviewing back to school fashion throughout history. My favorite back to school era is definitely the 70s because I really love bell bottoms. I think they're super flattering. I think definitely the 90s. I'm jealous of the people that could wear like that clothes when they were cool. It's a toss up between the 80s and the 90s. I really love the experimentation. Bring on the trends. Wow, plaid. Wow. Oh, it's plaid. She's wearing a plaid dress, he's wearing plaid pants, and she's wearing a plaid skirt, and they're all the same type of plaid. It's just like very excessive amount of plaid. I think plaid is a little too clueless for me. I'm digging the kind of smock look. It's retro. I'm gonna guess this is probably 90s. It's like, it's so 90s to me. I wanna say 70s? No? The 60s, I believe, is where this is from. It. It's funny, I've been looking for a pair of plaid pants like this, so if anyone knows where, I can find some. Oh my god. Woo! All right, first of all, the first thing I thought of was this girl looks like Ashley Simpson. Here we have these beautiful jeans. The little waistband, the stripe of skin above the hemline. I'm kind of horrified. These are both Abercrombie and Fitch. I don't know who is Aber I don't even know if Abercrombie and Fitch is still a thing. Maybe it is. I think so. It's funny how everyone in Abercrombie and Fitch ads all look exactly the same. Like they all have the same haircut, the same bone structure, the same I just got finished with rugby. And then the leopard print. And the crazy hair, crimping and curls and flat iron and oversized boots. This looks like early 2000s. Early 2000s. I knew it. Definitely early 2000s. Knew it. I feel like that was the one era that totally like the most clear to like stand out and like not in the best way. I'm not sure what trends are happening here. I really like the layering. I like the, the heavier jackets and the like black like pantyhose stockings that are like completely not even remotely see-through. Just a lot of like flannel. I think that this is like the 60s era. Uh, I want to say 70s. I feel like I'm totally wrong. 70s? Oh, hey, it's 70s. Wow, my least favorite. This looks very 80s supermodel to me. Love it. These are two different kinds of denim jackets. One of them is like a really nice boxy cut, and then the other one is kind of like a marching band style jacket. I like that the, the brows were really big and the hair was very fluffy and almost kind of like an easygoing, relaxed vibe. Early 90s? I was so close for the 80s. I think that this is the late 80s. I think my favorite era was definitely the 80s. I like that natural beauty was celebrated back then. If I could go back to any era, I think that I would pick the 90s for sure. I was definitely surprised by some of the trends that I thought were from a specific era, and I was totally wrong. So it just kind of shows how fashion, in a way, recycles itself.